Our Mark Bernheimer is standing by outside the courthouse of Santa Monica with the latest. Mark? Good afternoon, Chuck. It is a troubling question. How do you find 12 jurors and eight alternates who can somehow put aside their opinions about the most notorious or certainly most well-known murder trial in the history of the U.S.? It's not going to be easy. The process is underway in the courthouse behind me, and it could take weeks. We sent Mark Bernheimer to March Air Force Base to find out how the Air Force equips its pilots for the worst. Mark? Well, Pat, we wanted to find out how Scott O'Grady managed to survive that six-day ordeal, so we came here to March Air Force Base, where, with the help of some Air National Guardsmen, we got a closer look at the kind of plane O'Grady flew and the kind of equipment and training that kept him alive. The Orange County Registrar of Voters Office will now go to work verifying all those signatures. If a recall election does ultimately remove Allen from office, it'll be up to the district voters to replace her. But that new assembly member wouldn't necessarily become the new speaker. It's up to the assembly itself to fill that position. In Orange County, Mark Bernheimer, KCAL 9 News. It is interesting, Pat. You know, not so very long ago, the Hubble Space Telescope was the Rodney Dangerfield of NASA projects, what with its broken mirror and all. But uh, that's all changed now. The Hubble Telescope seems to have vindicated itself. Uh, and that is because the telescope has sent back, armed with a new camera, by the way, it has sent back some striking pictures of stars, very young stars. And by that, we mean two to 300,000 years old. Now, these pictures have magnification 10 times greater than anything that can be used here at the Griffith Observatory or anywhere else on the planet. Mark. Well, Paula, I'm at USC, where yet another rally is uh, getting underway right now behind me. You probably can't see it. It's a very small rally uh, that just got underway about 10 or 15 minutes ago with students from USC taking part. You know, the